Hey folks, it's Grimwit back at the Merchants of Kaiden. Um, I got, I, I actually did not intend to come back to this game, but uh, I got a request from a viewer. And one viewer, to me, is like 20 viewers to normal people. So when 20 people tell me, Hey, I can't wait to see what you're doing next with Emergence of Kaiden. I'm like, I guess I can't either. So, alright, uh, today's episode is brought to you worth by Werther's Original Coffee Candy because I don't want to mm, brew up a cup of coffee. There's a couple of problems with uh, Merchants of Kaiden I want to get into. First off, it's been like... It has literally been months since I've played. I don't know what I'm doing. And I have two games, so I'm not even sure if I'm in the right game. We're going to find out together. But uh, I was reading a review about it while looking up guides, and somebody brought up a good point with this game. Let's check out. Okay, I'm still a hawker. Okay, I'm still a hawker. So somebody brought out a good point with the uh, Merchants of Kaidan. As far as the trading game goes... It's actually kind of terrible because there's no good strategies. Instead, what you do is you, you look up a guide to figure out how much you'd be willing to buy a certain um, certain goods and then buy it at that price and go and try to find a place where you can sell it for more than that price. And uh, so it's actually more of a please, please game. Have a little pit pity on me and, and give me a low price. And I have to admit, that's a pretty good point. So, food. Try to shoot for eight or nine gold. Any more, don't touch. Hides. Shoot for about 12 gold. Any more, don't touch. Never buy food for 10 or more, by the way. Oil. Do not buy oil. Or, 36, roughly. 35 is actually what you actually want. Hill herb, no. Never get hill herb. Even when you buy it from the, uh, the barbarians, you still don't make a very good profit. Spices, about 65 gold a unit. Any more? Nah, you can get away with 66 or 67. The trouble is finding a place to spend it. Clothes. Clothes are better to deal with at the winter time, because that's when people start needing it more. 21. If it's more than 21 gold, you're kind of like, eh, this might be a little bit risky. Tools, 25. 25 gold for tools. Uh, any more than 25, and we're like, well, it's, it's all the same deal. Finally, jewels and porcelain, about 75 each. Now, the guide I was reading did not have carpets listed on here. What do I even have? I have food, I have clothes. There's another issue that uh, I was thinking about while I was searching for stuff, and that was, I mean, really how much of this game is worth looking at, because it all is pretty much the same old thing over and over again. Buy low, sell high, buy low, sell high, try to find a good spot, occasionally do a quest, which I guess is where the interest is, where do the quests hold for us. And I was thinking, you know what, maybe I shouldn't. Like, may whoa, whoa, wrong, wrong button. No, stop. Ah. Like, maybe I shouldn't show you guys everything like I have for the past five episodes. Because, what is there interesting to see? Hmm? Hmm? No, I don't know either. Let's see here. Clothes are for 20. Screw you. I'd like to sell more. Hmm. Get out of here. I, hmm. Well, I'm here for quests. What's up? Halt, sinner, repent. Repent while you still can. Now this is a chance to save your soul. Help a holy man get to Nar. I need to bring light to those in darkness, to those who stray, and the blessed reward may be on you. Oh, yeah, no problem. Just, uh, just be, please be quiet. Um, hey, luck went up by one. What's my luck now? It's like three, so it's as much as it can be. So, okay, well, um, here's how I'm going to do things. This is go going to get very disjointed from this point on. Because I figure you don't really need to see me doing all of the stuff. So, I instead, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... I'm just gonna 
go places and do things. Nars over here, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And uh, when things, when I get an interesting pop-up, then I'll, I'll start recording again, and then I'll just cut everything together. So, yeah, yeah, that's pretty much what we're going to do here. So, all right, I will see you guys on the other end of whatever craziness happens. What's going on? Why can I not travel to these places? Did they change the game? Dunalar, a peaceful agricultural city. Dunalar lies with... I don't care, I just want to go there. I have a travel log, that's cool, but... How do I travel to places? Why is there no option to travel anymore? Have I really forgotten how to do this? Okay, I figured it out. Hey, uh, you know how I'm a complete moron sometimes? Yeah, I'm a complete moron. There. I don't even... I am ashamed. I've been with I've been without playing this game for two months and I really did not know how to play the game anymore. What is wrong with me? Alright. See you at NAR. No, don't plunder. Cause I might get caught by people. Alright, we're at NAR. Deliver you. God bless you. Now I can confront the demon of corruption that is in its unholy ground with the might of my holy flame. He pulls out a lighter. My words of love and wisdom. Kablam! I shall save their souls. By force if necessary, bring back those who went astray in this city of thieves. Thank you, and may the blessing be upon you. Wow. Got some monies, I guess. <laughs> hey, you guys want food? You guys don't want food. Oh man, I got all this food and I don't know what to do with it. Hides are okay too. I don't see any other quests, so... I guess I'll see you guys on the other side of whatever I'm doing next. Hey, after almost a month, I finally find a place to sell all this food. But more importantly, I gambled a little bit with a trader and got some, uh... Got some clothes for... <clears throat> well, a good price. Pretty much what I paid for the food. Yay, there we go. Also, we have this guy. Oh, noble man, I am traveler from the lands away from the south. An academy started by the great sultan himself has sent me here to learn about the customs of the northern men. Would you mind me joining your caravan and, con and accompanying you on your travels? I will reward you handsomely for your inconvenience, especially if you take me to one particular place. I heard that somewhere in the north, there is a particularly interesting village. They say that every winter when the seas freeze, the seas freeze, the sea freezes, people erect buildings straight on the ice, a village in the middle of the sea. Take me there and I will give you a hefty reward. Well, of course, I'll gladly help. If nothing else, this guy is just kind of like, eh. What's this? Hey, you. Yeah, you. I may be drunk, but I am a noble man who can pay you well for a journey to Van Hoes. Vani Hoes. Take me there before I change my mind or sober up. Wait, have I already done this guy? I can't remember if I've done this guy or not. It's hard to remember what I've done on this playthrough and not the other playthrough. Oh well, whatever. We'll get him there. And looks like nothing else is good to sell here, so... We will move on. Vanna Jose! The other guy, the other quest, this guy, I've run into his quest before. I got 200 days to solve it. It's not too big a deal, but we have to wait until winter when the ice freezes over. And then a town called Magnus will show up. I've never been to Magnus. I don't know what's there. All right. Onwards. All right. What? What is this place? Hope this isn't Chris's place. I don't even know why that joke. That, that, you will never get that reference. Never mind. This is Van, Vani Hose? Really? It doesn't look like the one in the painting I have here. That means my fair lady lives in another city. She painted you a picture of where she lives? Why did I come up with Vani Hose? No, just take me to Sultara. Bring me some wine. Uh, you might be able to... Ooh, I can actually get rid of this food. 
Oh, even better. I can get rid of these oars. I stopped at a place and uh, sent all of my men to their deaths to get me like four or five pieces of ore. And some diamonds. Hmm. Gonna wait that out. Six is pretty low. Yeah, yeah, bridge tall. All right, dude. Oh, horror. Horror. This begotten place can be on the only one I'm looking for. It can't be. Oh, this can't be the play, the one I'm looking for. I need wine to withstand these foul realities that bite m at my eyes. And head for Urgane. Urgune. It must be the place. Oh, God. This guy's just jerking me around. Oh, hey, I wanted to hire you. Might be I hire you too. No? Nope. nope. I've also been on the forums in Steam. Um, nobody gives good information. Here, have a beer anyway. Ooh, a recipe for immortality. Eating a beating heart of a dragon. I, I don't know if I'd do that. Thank you. I'd probably get the dragon to drag my cart around. That would be really awesome. And that's why they call him a wagon dragon. All right, all right. Um, I'll see you at Urgune, I guess. What is this? You, good day. You seem one of the tidy types. You see, I need to get to Notifor. Hey, I actually need to as well. These are urgent matters I need to attend to, and my carriage broke, so if you have some space for my belongings, I don't. <laughs> I would reimburse you for 400 which is chump change to me anyway. You know what? Screw it. Get on board. Uh, yeah, we'll open that. An unidentified item. We'll check that out later. Um, let's check that, like... How much room I have dedicated to this woman's clothes. Wow, 85. That's wrong. I bought all those clothes. So, okay, she's not even on there. Does it show, she show up as a quest? Dire need, 50 days. I can get to note of her in 53 days. That's cool. Wine for blood, which is almost done. On the soul, on solid ice, which is later. We're getting closer to, uh, to winter, it seems. Anybody want some clothes here? Or one additional? Eh, eh. Eh, we'll see what else we can do. Alright, to Urgune, and then... Oh, that's, this is Urgune. And then onward to Notifor. When the traveling merchants run out of funds and is forced to make an auction of some of his possession to fa pay for a further trip? I've never seen this. I'll participate. State what price you are willing to pay for wood. Depending on your bid, you will get that auction stock. I don't know how, mo how good wood is. Um, how much is the most? 24 gold? You know what? That seems steep. Let's go about halfway. It's about like 15, and that would be my wife. It wouldn't be one of my Let's Plays if she weren't uh, sending me stuff. Let's do this. I won 43 pieces of wood for a total of 6,500, uh, 650 gold. I did not expect to was that per unit did i just pay way too much i'm about to find out hey it's uh seasons profits thank you that was that was useful all right <laughs> let's uh let's get rid of this guy right here oh dear my head is awful my dear friend truly awful but this place is wait this is the place I need to get hit, get off. I'm sorry. I need to get of here quickly. Here's your gold. Thank you for the trip. And you should buy better wine f for the future. Goodbye. Thank you. Whoa. He gave me a decent amount of gold. Yeah. And actually, you know what? I made a pretty nice killing with the wood. I mean, that's a lot of money right there. Boom. Ooh, that's enough to get a new cart. And I want a new cart. Here's my third cart. Here we go. I want one. Wait, 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 wait. Four, because I've no been known to mess up before. Let me go ahead and save. All right, now. Uh, 4,200 isn't terrible for one of these carts right here. And it carries, it'll basically double the amount I can carry, which is awesome. Let's go ahead and buy just one. 
Okay, and that increases the amount that we can carry to 1,300 kilograms. And now I can really start playing into the food market. Oh yeah. Um, actually, the other thing is I have found that I've started really liking these guys. How many do I have? Just the, uh, hmm. Let me get some more, okay. Um, I should explain. One, these guys do cut down on time if you get one for every cart that you have. So I'm looking at 3,000 here, which is actually money that's going to be coming at me real fast now that I have a larger uh, space to carry goods with. But the other thing is, whenever you're running from bandits, when you have... What are these called? Leechalians? Whenever you have a Leechalian on your cart, you will always outrun the bandits. Very good stuff. So I'm going to come back for these guys later. In the meantime, yes, I say, will you lend a hand to a man in trouble? These bloody thieves stole my carriage. Oh, this guy. Yeah, we got the room now. I'll help you out. I received 500 of junk. All right, how much room do I even have left? Oh, plenty. I got plenty of room for junk. Oh, let's see here. What do we got? Ore is super low. I might get some ore. And carpets. I've been taking, keeping an eye on carpets because I wasn't sure how much to buy or sell it at. Carpets looks like it's in the same deal as oil. Like it will always buy higher than it sells, which makes it makes no sense to me. So, okay, i got to go to Notifor, and let's see if Notifor likes ore. Oh, that was a bad move. Oh, that was a terribly bad move. How much money does it take to get to the next town? It'll take more than I have. I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. God damn it. I clicked without thinking. I have to sell some of the ore back at a loss. Oh, God, I'm so dumb. All right. I need about... You know, 200 will probably get me someplace where I can sell this ore, so we'll do that. Alright, let's try that again, this time with less stupidity. Yeah, bridge toll. Uh, actually, you know what? I need an extra mercenary, sure. You guys like ore? You guys want ore? You don't want ore? Oh, great. All right, I'll see you at Nordafor, I guess. Okay, one of my quests, the merchant quest, told me to go to Varig, which is the opposite way as Nordafor. So I have to go the opposite way. Onward, I guess. Yeah, I keep forgetting these things. I keep making these little mistakes, which are terrible. It's a good price for that. Ah, it's all. It's always got to be something, you know. One little mistake. Uh, let's join. Still, I've made a lot of money back, mostly. But, uh... No, none of these are good. The clothes are okay-ish. And pretty soon i got to start worrying about, um... Now that it's winter, it's going to start icing up, and I'm not sure where this will show up. Maybe over on this side? I'm not worried about it. If I don't complete this quest where I have to meet a guy on the ice, then I'm not going to be too terribly freaked out about it. He'll come just on the next year. All right. Hey, merchant. There we go. Well, it's not as good as it ought to be. While I was struck by, stuck in Urgune, the price has dropped. I'm broke. Unless you can take me to, with you to Nuremberg. I know someone there... That, it cannot fail. Ah, I gotta go to Nordifor, man. Alright, maybe we can do something. Damn it, I need to go to Nordifor and help this lovely little lady. Ah. He wants he wants to head to Narringham. Where where even is Narringham? Oh, it's up north. That'll give me enough to cut across in order for if I beeline it. And this actually should be it. Okay, okay, let's do this. Let's get this guy to, to, to Nottingham. Did I say Nottingham? 
At least those took the one day longer. Yay. Just slow me down. Um, hmm. Clothes went up. See, this is what I'm talking about. I wish I could buy a warehouse somewhere and just start storing clothes in the warehouse when it's like super low and then during the winter time come back and sell it out. Because uh, what was I, uh, I think I was talking about Ocean Trader in the very first episode of this. That's what I used to do is I used to buy super low and then when like prices rose because of something, I would go to that place and just sell all my goods from my warehouse. Oh yeah. Or was that another trading game? It all blurs together after a while. <sighs> I've never visited this place. That's not right. Help him out. Get one of these things. Alright. Finally. Splendid. Here's your cash and something extra. I managed to get even at least... I managed to get even at least. Oh, he's talking about even like... Oh, God, my brain. I managed to get even at least. There needs to be a comma there. I'll be damned if I ever set foot in Ragune again. And you should do the same. Be damned. Okay, I lost 500x. But I got a good amount of cash, and I'm cool with that. Um... Hmm. I think about what I'm going to buy and where. It's winter time. Is there some town up here yet? I was told that it was just north, but they wouldn't tell me how to get there. I guess I could hug the coast, and I am not going to grab that quest right there because I've got my own quest. I need to get this girl to Notifer, and I really don't have a lot of time. I got less than a month. All right, well... I'll, I'll keep an eye out for Magnus, the, the town at the edge of the ice, and we'll see what happens.